the leaders is that as far as the referendum is concerned, uh, Italians have voted very clearly, a 69% vote in favour of reducing that figure. So from 945 parliamentarians down to 600 in both the Senate as well as the lower house. Now, this really was a populist proposal championed by the anti-establishment five-star movement, which is currently in government, in coalition with the centre-left Democratic Party. And one of the leaders of uh, the Five Star Movement, uh, Luigi Di Maio, uh, Italy's foreign minister, uh, speaking just earlier, said that this was a historical result that Italy would now go back to becoming having a normal parliament. Uh, he says it's a victory for all. And he says this is simply a start. And the next target perhaps will be cutting the salaries of politicians as well. So uh, what's clear is that what's going to be necessary at this stage is a change to the voting or electoral system as a whole because of this cut in the number of parliamentarians. And uh, at least as far as the next elections are concerned, which are technically due uh, not till 2023.